everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. The weatherman says we're going to have 70 degree temperature by Sunday. Yahoo! <laughs> Who would think that I'd say 70 is good? But after 40s, lower, middle, low to middle 40s, 70 sounds really good. And lots of sunshine. We've had a lot of rain. And today was election day, so if you haven't voted, you still have time. It's early enough. I think, at least it's early enough here in New York. I think the other states are too, as, 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 yeah. as you go across. Yeah, because I'm in the East Coast. So. Of course, it all depends on when this is actually posted. Yeah, well, it could be late. <laughs> Maybe you better go now. Run, run, run. <laughs> <laughs> they said that if you're in line at 9, at least in New York, if you're in the line and the 9 o'clock comes, the the police officer or whoever is there, the person guarding it, will go into the end of the line. But those that are in line get to vote, but anybody else that comes in won't be able to. So let's hope you have done it already. I did mine earlier, and they talk about all these lines that are so around buildings. It's a lot of baloney, in, at least in our area it is. Maybe the cities. I don't think so, because even there they had a hard time finding buildings they were showing days before when everybody was doing the early voting the the votes today that people were saying they got in got out and there was rain the days that they had the early voting and today was a nice day there was no rain it was a rather nice day and tomorrow's supposed to be even sunnier well i wanted to show you because i did do it now um pamela had talked about a new way of crocheting. I made a washcloth is what I made. But she made she showed this pattern where you you crocheted around the post. And I wanted I wanted to try it, so I thought, well, I will do a washcloth. And I also did it on a she did a cowl and I did a couple rows of this on the cowl also. And I finished that up, but I didn't bring that in here, but it, I made the cowl out of the rest of this material. This is a basket. Looks like it could be a hat. Um, mm -hmm. It could be, but it's not. It's a basket, and it's for my washcloths that I'm making to put them in there. And I have to make a few more. But that's this. This is just plain old basic um, single crochet. And this one was that new way where you you crocheted around the post. I liked that. That was kind of fun. I wanted to try it, and this was a nice, easy project. I did see a pattern where they had a man's scarf was made with this, and so it must be a masculine-looking um, stitch. So if you want to make a scarf with it, it's a good stitch for that, too. i am also been real busy gathering numbers for those Shed Wars, and I've got every team now. I have all the team. And Oh, you you have to wait, though. I'm not going to tell you who won. Mm -hmm. I have just emailed Deb and Ernie so that they can um, look it over, and they have to get back to... I have to know what their vote is. We all have to vote and see who they vote for, and then I'll... I'll I know who I'm going to vote for. And... Um, it's going to be fun. You're going to you're going to wonder, did I win? And well, I, and then I don't know who's supposed to distribute the seeds. That's not my part. I'm just to, to tell you who wins. So, the seed part, that's somebody else's. I don't know who's supposed to do that or how or where um that happens. But let's keep keep an ear opened. It's going to happen on Saturday. I'm going to put my video out Saturday as to who won. And I'm going to wait to hear from Deb and Ernie. I'm waiting to hear from you. <laughs> In case you see this, I need to hear your vote so that we can, um, when I make my video, I can post who the winner is. So, uh, and thank you, Mark, and thank you, um, Rob, and thank you, Robert. They got me the numbers that I needed. I thank you so much. And thank you for those of you that had your videos where you put the numbers in. That was really good, too. And thank you, Eva. She also sent me numbers. And thank you for everybody that sent numbers. Um, I will talk to you all again tomorrow, so take care. Bye.